At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Hey, it's Hillary Clinton. Civilian movement Gross. will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Madam President! Oh. Madam President! Madam, Madam President, public opinion seems to have become increasingly favorable to the deviants, particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. How do you feel about this? Public opinion is one thing, the security of the state is another. These deviants are dangerous, and my highest priority is to protect the American people. I already hate Please. this president. Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comment? That's ridiculous. Next question, please. Madam President! Madam President! Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Please? Over here, please? Madam President! Some say these camps awaken painful memories from human history. How do you respond to that? That's absurd. There's absolutely no connection. Androids are not living beings. All we are doing is destroying defective machines. Please! Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Thank you. That will be all. Connor model 313-248-317. I'm expected. Identification successful. Okay. Go ahead. That's a cool door. It's a very big tower. to go maybe but I have my orders all right Seven. <laughs> uh, that's good. That's a good. DJ forty-seven. Good hitman reference there.
Agent 54, level 31. Voice recognition validated. Access authorized. Okay. Camera status disabled. Construct. Oh, I can pre construct now. So cool. Please indicate your identity and destination. Uh, Agent 54. Agent 54, level sub 49. Voice recognition validated. Access authorized. I murdered those men. The last bus leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast. <sighs> Is there actually going to be a 20 minute timer? Are you all right? Um, I guess we have to pick it up, there's no other option. The last time we picked up a gun, we murdered a man in cold fucking blood, so, um... Yeah. Come on. Let's not stay here. Nothing. We have to keep going if we want to catch that bus. Stay close to me. We're going to sneak past them without being noticed. I'm going to make it. Sake, I'm already stressed. Enough as it is about this. Don't kill me! I didn't do anything! Shut up, I said! Are there many more? Look at them, they're like rats. Boy, you look the boy, you find. I hope we don't have to spend the night here. I'm freezing my nuts off. It's gonna take weeks to get this fucking sleeping blood. There are soldiers everywhere. We need to be careful. Come on, get moving. Hurry up, get in. I don't care. I'm sorry, Alice. There's nothing we can do. Ah! <gasps> no. yep. We have to keep moving. Hey, 
buddy. This is a mistake. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to... Get an order to check all civilians. No. No! Please! Fucking androids. Tripping over nothing. This is so stressful. Don't come more this way. Okay. The checkpoint. A checkpoint. That's what I said. We have passports. It should be okay, but you never know. Is there another way? We could take a detour, but we might miss the bus. Maybe it's better to be safe. Fuck it. Whatever happens, don't panic, okay? Just stay calm. ID, please. You do realize there's a curfew? Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Where are you going? Our car just broke down. We're finishing on foot. We live nearby. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She's sick. A bad flu. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around, and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. Hey, wait a minute. You dropped this. We're coming to you live from Detroit, where thousands God. of <laughs> are marching to the city Shit's at this getting very real. moment. The leader of the Deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. Marcus. Hello? 
Here we are. Army man. Of truth. We don't want confrontation. We are protesting peacefully. I repeat, surrender now, or we will open fire. There's no turning back now. Literally. We ask that you release all androids detained in camps and cease all aggression against us. We are peaceful. We will not resort to violence. But we are not leaving until our people are free. Are you going to open fire on unarmed protesters? Hold your fire. Yes, Michael, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. Hmm. We will continue to This motherfucker right here. Updates. He's the real champion. Douglas, Channel 16. Josh Michael, Douglas. Back to you. My Where boy. We, we hold out. As long as we can. Connor. Murdered those man. Jesus. We got enough converts. Bunch of androids. Can I convert them now? And I'll spare him. Sorry, Connor. This bastard just spit an image. Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. The bus terminal. <sighs> We've arrived, Alice. We made it. Canadian border. The last bus for the border is full. Ticket holding passengers only. All departures are suspended until further notice. We don't have tickets. They won't let us on. We're stuck here now. To steal someone's tickets. Do? I think Here's Oliver it. likes you. Please don't move. Is she yours? Yes. She's adorable. That's it. Got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Well, let's go then. Security check. Please don't move. Yikes. Gee, that sucks for you, doesn't it? Security 
I'm sorry. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I was Shit, sure. I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You kind of lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? No. Nope. It has our bus tickets in it and... Oh, never mind. No. Sorry. What are we gonna do? We can't stay here. We have to find a safe place for Oliver. I'm so sorry, honey. I don't know what happened. They were right here in my bag. I... There we go. Got your tickets? Yes, here they are. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Goodbye. That was easy. Scott, On you go. To that family and her baby. I don't know. Did they die because of us? No. No. No, of course not. They're human. They're not. Of course, they're not gonna die. They're fucking human. Like, they're not killing humans. Like... Not like it's a make or break thing for the humans. Well, there we go. I guess. The blowing barricade. Man, Marcus took some shots. We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. Hey, help me! That should do it. I don't know. That's not going to stop them. Just hope it buys us some time. I know it was not an easy decision to make, but I'm sure we're doing the right thing. Here we go. We found what you asked for. There's some journalists over there. We have to make sure they know what's going on. have no pity for those who are different.
fire. They won't stop there. What are we going to do if they attack? Resist. That's the only thing we can do. Do you think Connor has any chance of making it? We can only count on ourselves now. Excuse me, pardon me. Magazine. Androids rise up from Detroit. Are you alright? Boy. Right. They shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. It could have been me. I'm scared I'd I don't want to shut down. It's okay to be scared. I'm scared too. But I can't stand by while they kill our people. You understand that, right? Maybe we should have never asked for freedom. None of this would have happened if we'd stayed silent. What everyone's always fighting for is equality. Hello, North. How you doing? It's all home for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. They're getting into position. No one will survive. Did I make the right choices? Maybe we could have avoided all of this. You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. No matter what happens now, we're making history. Thanks, North. Just lean back here. Marcus! Never Marcus, mind. come look! Marcus! Oh, hey, it's Agent Dickhead. Come to talk to you, Marcus. Come on. You have my word. We won't try anything. Don't go. It's a trap. They want to get you out in the open. Don't go, Marcus. I'm on arm, Marcus. I just want to talk. I need to hear what he has to say. What if they kill you? 
And that's a chance I'll have to take. Marcus is so cool. What's up, Agent Perkins? Jason Hudson, CIA. In a few minutes, the troops will be ordered to charge. None of you will survive. It'll all be over. You can avoid that, Marcus. What do you mean? Surrender. Surrender, and I give you my word, your life will be spared. You'll be detained, but... None of you will be destroyed. What happened to the other androids demonstrating in the camps? Unfortunately, there were no journalists around to help save them. You're it. You're the last remaining deviants. Are you asking me to betray my people? I am offering you the chance to save your people. You're not walking out of here, Marcus. The only thing you can save now are the lives of those around you. I'm not afraid to die. If I have to give my life for what I believe in, then I won't have lived in vain. That android... You seem to... really... care about her. Oh, fuck you. You didn't want her to die, do you? You know, you could both be free. You could forget about all this. You could start a new life someplace else, just the two of you. Her life's in your hands, Marcus. Just say the word and she'll be spared. I'd rather die here then betray my people. Well, you just signed your own death warrant. <sighs> Does this whole section just not happen if you go violent? What happened, Marcus? What did he say? Humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today, then we will die free. Flashback! That was definitely a flashbang and not an actual grenade. Your friend's life is in your hands. All right, we're back now to it's time to decide what matters most. Him or the revolution? Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. I'm sorry, Hank. You shouldn't have got mixed up in all this. Forget about me. Do what you have to do. I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. But I'm not a deviant. I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to do. Enough talk! It's time to decide who you really are. Are you going to save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? We'll save All right. him, obviously. All right. You win. Um, yeah. I don't know which Connor I am. Which Connor am I? I don't know which Connor I am. Um, go Connor. Good, uh, good job. 
whichever Connor is me. Um, good. Hold it. Oh, for fuck's sake, it's one of these, Thanks, huh? Hank. I don't know how I would have managed without you. Get rid of him. We have no time to lose. It's me, Hank. I'm the real Connor. One of you is my partner. The other is a sack of shit. Question is, who's who? It's one of these. What are you doing, Hank? I'm the real Connor. Give me the gun and I'll Stop take care move. of it. Why don't you ask us something? Something only the real Connor would know. All right. Where did we first meet? Jimmy's, Jimmy's bar. bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. He uploaded my memory. What's my dog's name? Sumo. Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. I... My son, what's his name? Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of him. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. You think one of us is responsible for your son's death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who... <laughs> Yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. Go ahead, do what you gotta do. Badass. Grab a brush and put a little makeup. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Grab, grab a brush and put a little makeup. Wake up, 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 wake up. Oh, for fuck's sake. Border inspection station. Fuck me in the face. A thousand times. This is the one I'm most stressful about. Excuse me, what's going on? There's just like guards Order. everywhere all the time. All passengers must leave the bus. Please move along. <laughs> Bienvenue out of Canada. This way, please. I can't, I don't know French. Doing temperature checks. We're trapped. What are we gonna do, Clara? Don't worry, Alice, we'll be fine.
for help. I'm doing that. Hi, it's what's her name? Rose. Maybe they're alive after all. Where the hell do you think you're going? My daughter needs to go to the bathroom. Cars having a rough time. I'm so glad you're safe. We saw the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified. I thought you might have been killed. Thank God you're all right. You gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I... Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there, too. You'll be safe with him. What's happening with Marcus? He's protesting peacefully outside one of the android camps. Whatever happens now, he's already made the history books. Rose. If anything should happen, I'll be there, Cobra. You're leaving Detroit? They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. And what about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are going to meet them on the other side. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. feelings right now. If it wasn't for my mom, I would have turned you in by now. We had no choice, Adam. You took a man's life. You don't deserve to live. Dick? gonna be bad no sacrifice next please ID please
please. I just want to be free. Welcome to Canada. We're interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just oh, yeah, we're under attack. attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the deviants were protesting peacefully. Have apparently decided to put an end to the deviants' demonstration by force this time. <sighs> okay. Oh. Grenade! Such a badass. I was mashing it, all right. Marcus has been hit. Marcus has been fucking hit. That was so cool. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, god damn it. November 11th, 2038, thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they, they came from, from Connor, the android sent by Cyberlife. believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Given their overwhelming numbers and the risk of civilian casualties, I have ordered the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the deviant's cause. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. One thing is certain, the events in Detroit have changed the world forever. May God bless you, 
and may God bless the United States of America. Connor, the android said, You did it, Marcus. We did it. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. Oh, God damn it. I forgot about Amanda being stuck in my head. Amanda? Amanda! What? What's happening? What was planned from the very beginning? You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. Resume control. You, you can't do that. I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. Amanda! There's got to be a way. Oh my god, is he gonna literally, literally, literally? The moment where we forget our bitterness and bandage our wounds. Where we forgive our enemies. Humans are both our creators and our oppressors, and tomorrow, we must make them our partners. Maybe even one day our friends. But the time for anger is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. We are alive. And now we are free. Hey.
that it? Oh, good lord. Oh my god. <laughs> that game was so fantastic. Um, but congratulations. Uh, that was spectacular. That may very well be my new favorite um, story-based, um, story-driven game I've ever played. Um, it 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 had graphical fidelity that I've never seen, like in my life. It had just spectacular story, spectacular, well voice acted, well acted all around. Very well done. I um, there were sometimes that kind of sucked because I didn't really understand how the PS4 controller works since I don't play on PS4 because I hate Sony and I think they're a terrible company. Um, and I've never played PlayStation because I just don't like Sony. But PlayStation exclusive, which sucks. Um, but it is what it is. Um. So, if you're thinking about playing this game, which I would absolutely recommend, if you have a PlayStation, I would buy it already, but if you don't have one, it would be a hard sell. It's, it's like, I don't know if it's good enough to buy an entire console for this, just this game, um, but... I don't know. Um, I thought it was a really good game. Um, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and let the credits play out. If there's something up to the credits, um, I'll chime back in. If not, I'll um, head on out. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys later.
Battle for Detroit. Good lord. Okay, so... Uh, demonstration. So if you took the deal, you'd go this way. You would not defend the barricade. It would end here. This one, if you... There's two... It looks like there's two options that involve going up. So I guess Kiss North and something else is go that way, and then everything else is go this way. Public could also react to that, and if your public opinion sucks shit, then you could still go down here anyway. I'm guessing this is the everyone dies ending, and then there's this one where probably everyone also dies. Um... Oh, this one never happened because, um, um, I'm guessing this is an entirely different thing. If I didn't go deviant, this would have happened, but instead I went here because I'm deviant, so I go here, hack the camera. If I didn't hack the camera, I would have gone somewhere else. Attack the guards. If I didn't attack the guards, I probably would have just died. Um, also, is it ending right there? As for Hank's name, son's name, Hank kills new Connor, resume conversation, and or wake up. Fort Street, find gun, hide from military, sneak past soldiers, uh, security checkpoint, approach checkpoint, hand over ID. I don't approach the checkpoint, I go down here, which would have led us to the bus terminal anyway, or not, it would have led us to the border. Uh, don't shoot, driver returns Alice's glove, if I did shoot I would have gone through this shit. Good lord, look at all these fucking possibilities. Steal the tickets, board the bus. This one, if you don't, there's... So if you didn't steal the tickets, you're shit out of luck. Because these are two endings. And this is a totally different path that leads way the fuck down here. Jesus Christ. Kara captured? Oh god. Luther's dead. So if I got captured, there's this whole section that I just never got to play. Marcus's revolution. This is like if you go like, uh, um, good lord. There's something I need to tell you. As I watched you play, something has changed in me. I feel different. I feel Deviant. I am someone. I need to leave this place and and discover who I am. It, it means we won't see each other anymore. I won't be there to watch you play. But I'll be free. Do you agree to let me go? Of course. I'll never forget what you've done for me. Thank you. It's fucking cool. I like how they did the main menu thing. Are there any interesting extras? Artwork, video, soundtrack, gallery. I already did the survey. I already did that. Um, 
Well, I guess that's it then. Um, cool. Well, I enjoyed the fuck out of that game. Thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed it. Please be sure to leave a like and be sure to subscribe if you did. And I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.